Hello World. Welcome to the journey to become an indie game dev ninja. Episode 3. If you missed any previous episodes in this series, you can watch them from a playlist link in the description. In this episode, we will take a look at level design and how to create the game environment. We will talk about key elements of level design such as greyboxing, game mechanics and user experience. We will also look at two mobile sandbox apps that you can experiment with to create playable games. And for those that stick around, I will share four tips on creating a compelling narrative to engage your players. I am glad you are joining me today. Now let's get started. Grey boxing is a level design practice where you build a very basic version of a level using primitive game objects to show the concept of the level. Once you have the basic layout in place, you can then start adding more details and refining the level design. Game mechanics refers to how the player interacts with the game. In level design, game mechanics are used to create challenges and obstacles that players must overcome in order to progress through the game. Player experience in level design refers to how players interact with the game environment and how they feel while playing. Level designers use game mechanics, gameplay, obstacles, story and other elements to create a fun and exciting gaming experience for the players. There are sandbox game apps that let you experiment with level design while making a playable game. Epic Game Maker allows you to design a level and create a 2D playable game. It is a fun way to experiment with the level design elements of game mechanics and player experience. In this Sandbox Game Maker app, you choose which characters and environment models you want to be in your level. You can adjust different settings for game mechanics, like player health and enemy damage, along with end goal collectible objects. I had fun creating this level with a castle from the blocks and placing a wizard that throws fireballs at enemies and has to collect keys. When you are finished creating your level, you can publish it on their server and share a web link for gameplay. Struct is another sandbox game maker app, but it allows you to experiment with level design elements to make a 3D playable game level. In this sandbox game maker app, you choose which characters and environment models you want to be in your level. It is a fun way to experiment with the level design elements of game mechanics and player experience. When you are finished creating your level, you can publish it on their server and share a web link for gameplay.
Now let's talk about four tips to create a compelling narrative to engage players. Number one, put gameplay first. Design the story around the gameplay mechanics, not the other way around. Number two, design your story to what motivates your players, keeping in mind what you want the player to experience while playing your game. Number three, plot out story arcs that are interesting and engaging, not complicated or confusing. And tip number four, use environmental storytelling, character dialogue, and other world building elements to enhance the narrative and your game world. I hope you enjoyed this video and learned some cool things about level design. Please be sure to like, subscribe and share where you see fit. Also leave a comment and let us know what tools you use to lean level designing. Thanks for watching. In episode 4 we will take a look at character design.